a, a part of who we are, just baked into the fi fabric of being Tyson Foods. And, and by the way, spelled out in our core values, is this idea that, yes, we have an economic responsibility. Um, we also have a responsibility to the environment around us. And we also have a responsibility to the communities we serve. And let me try to talk about those last two a little bit. Um, we have, and I think it's a distinct privilege, of having facilities in some of the most beautiful parts of our country. And most of our facilities, not all, but most, are in small rural communities where we are at least a uh, predominant employer, if not sometimes the dominant employer, but, but not always. So because we're a member of the community, I think that does give us a, a responsibility socially to, to take care of Number one, the environment around us. I'll talk about that in a second. But, but more as importantly, the whole community we live in. I tell you, our people, they serve on PTAs, uh, serve on school boards. They coach ball teams. Um, they're involved in their churches. Um, they're involved in any kind of disaster relief that may happen in those communities. Um, they're involved in all kinds of fundraising drives. We're a huge contributor to the United Way. Um, and, and by the way, something that's important to us, um, too, is as a food company, we, we think it's abhorrible that hunger is as prevalent as it is in our country and in the world. And so we think we have a responsibility, maybe above a lot of others, as a food company, to make a meaningful impact in hunger, particularly in America, but also around the world. So we are a huge donor of our products, protein products, to food banks all over the country. I'll give you some, some quick facts. Since probably the turn of the century, when we really be began a deliberate effort uh, you know, against hunger in America, we've given over 70 million pounds of product in that, in that period of time. And, and I'm going to say that's a little over a quarter of a billion meals. And now food banks don't get a lot of meat protein. And so, you know, we, we feel like we have a, a niche for them that we can fill better than, than anyone else. And we take that very, very seriously. So if, if you wrap all that together, our folks are involved in every community, you know, in every aspect of the community. And then they're also involved in communities they're not even a part of. I mean, if we're, if we're part of a food donation in South Texas, you know, I, I, don't, I don't live in South Texas, but the people in South Texas are important to me. And if there's something I can do to impact their lives positively and, and, and help them and help the children in that community, we are absolutely going to do that. And then, too, wrapped up in all of this um, uh, area of responsibility is also our environmental responsibility. And we take that very, very seriously. Again, we're members of all the communities that we work in. And, and we have um, environmental management systems that are second to none, certainly in our industry, and, and I would tell you industry leading in a lot of ways around protecting water quality, around air emissions, all those type things. Um, and that, that, that's so important to us because we, we do think we're stewards of the land that we're given. Um, you know, environmental impacts in, um, you know, we're part of Smart Way and our trucks, it's an emissions control um, uh, program. We're a part of that. Uh, here recently, you know, taking our raw materials and finding ways to make renewable fuels out of those raw materials, that's important to us. We're doing that. So just lots of stuff going on all over the country um, to, you know, to make a meaningful impact in, in society from an environmental standpoint and from that social responsibility view.